My dudes, it's finally happening. We're finally getting a new machine. Peggy 12. What's going on everyone? My name's Tenebris Infinite and I am so hyped to talk about this. We are finally seeing our first signs of the landfall update and it is absolutely massive. This new machine looks like a tank that's been, you know, lifting weights for the past like, I guess, year here in the game, waiting to come around and just muck show us. I can't believe it, dudes. And there's destroyed tanks all around it too. The craziness. The Russians are coming. I was right. I was right. Going all the way back to 2019. I've been right all along. Nobody believed me that it was the Russians. But I was telling you dudes, it, the Russians. <laughs> okay, I need to calm down for a moment so that we can actually break down this 30 second clip here because there is a lot to break down. So starting off this trailer, we get a panning shot of a road filled with destroyed Phoenix machines that we've been fighting against all along. But a very key detail here is that there is a lighthouse in the background. And more so, it's a lighthouse that's on the left-hand side. So that means this is one of two regions. This is either marshlands, or this is either the mountains region just beneath it. And I am willing to bet that it's going to be marshlands. I've been on the money all along this whole time, dudes. We are seeing some sort of a crazy DLC uh, or potentially update, but I'm willing to bet that this is gonna come with some sort of a DLC attached to it, some sort of a story expansion to the game that's going to take place more than likely in the marshlands. Though it could be even bigger than that. <laughs> oh, buddy. So next up, let's take a look at this new machine. And he's big, man, he's big. He looks like he's like a, a, even bigger than a harvester, potentially, I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell like how wide this dude is, but he's clearly tall because he's like towering over these destroyed machines and stuff. And I don't know, man, it just like the Soviet machine looks very futuristic and I really, really enjoy its design. But even more so, I think I'm going to enjoy tearing this thing apart. Now, the other thing in this trailer that we can kind of glean from it is that there's a bunch of destroyed machines. Now, I might be reading into this, but I don't think that the Soviet machines are going to be friendly to the Phoenix machines. I think that Potentially, my dudes, and this is gonna be crazy for Generation Zero. I think we're going to get a new faction that will potentially be doing its own combat with Phoenix machines. Now, of course, I could be totally wrong, but that's just what it looks like in this trailer. And if that's what happens, dudes, that's gonna be so insane to witness in the game. Then to jump in and, like, take out whoever's left or just join in in the chaos, like, Man. So as of right now, there are no announced dates for when this is going to be coming around other than coming soon. But I'm, I'm very, very hopeful for this one, my dudes. It could potentially come through with the next update or it could potentially be something set for a little bit later on here, uh, but still within the estimation of soon. Uh, we're going to have to wait to figure out the exact date for that, so make sure that you're subscribed to my channel so that you don't miss out when that date is announced. So I think we're going to round off here and we're going to let that trailer play through just one more time because my dudes, oh, it gave me like goosebumps the first time I watched it. But uh, we're going to kind of round off here and I just want to know what do you dudes think of this in the comments down below. Uh, hopefully you all are very stoked to see the landfall co uh, update come out. It is 
jam-packed, my dudes. It is absolutely packed with crazy, crazy features. This is going to be such a good year. Uh, so thank you for watching. Stay awesome, and I will catch you all in the next one. Until then, peace.